possums and welcome to another episode of year in review and what a fabulous year 2007 has been we begin tonight's review with two very handsome young men good friends of mine actually as they bring us the highlights of the year that was Lindley, here we are again. Now I remember back to last year, Lindley, then um, the deposed Craig Hogan, and you you sat yeah, in the same place. Yeah, that actually caused a bit of ill feeling. Mm. Now you mention it between Craig and myself, I don't understand why. We are in the P office. We are in the P office, PE office, Richard, and it really is a joy to be in here. And, and, and the most delightful parts of the school. And you understand our, <laughs> our basic purpose here today, Lindley, is to review the Year 12 who they are, what they've done, and what they've yeah, possibly done. Yes, their impact on, 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 on the place. Jesus, yes, yes. Uh, oh, Hoagie. Sure, Hoagie. Clearly, Hoagie is back. Tosses yeah, is, is he in a bad mood? Right. We have a dilemma. Some of, the, some of the bloody kids are just as bad. Where's the, the beers language, gone? Language, Richard. Where's the beers gone? Oh, g'day, Ira. Oh, Craig. Craig. You're, you're back, mate. You're, you're, you're back, back from England. Back in the shed, mate. Good well, thank you very much. Yes, thank you. Well, we have a dilemma because... This is your seat. This is your spot. It's a traditional oh, Craig Hogan review yeah. of the year 12. Yeah, he, now, slipped. he slipped in. Yeah, he, 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 I am more but, happy. But yeah, he, he's taken this badly. He believes I've usurped. Can you handle usurp, well, Richard? Usurp. Craig, can you handle that? Who's got a dictionary? Where is that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's he believes Macbeth like I came in. Macbeth like. And usurped his position. And Can you be largely usurped? Or uh, often usurped, or just you, you, you usurped. Usurped. Is that anything like tapering? Usurped. Am I in the wrong section? You're not only in the wrong section, Craig, you're really out of your depth, full stop, when it, it comes to these matters. Usurp. How do you spell it, mate? You Huggy, Huggy, this is, is, it? This is only a two person couch, Craig. It is a two person couch. I think couch. you're going to have to have a rock off. So that's, that's a course, unless Kel wants to do it. On that off. note, Kelvin's on that nice. note, well, I think they should rock off, Hoagie. I rock think off. there should be a rock off. Think I had a rock off? A rock off. I am. I will rock off. And I must admit, Ray, Richard, thank you very much for your support on this. I don't see oh, it. Oh, yeah. it's just the PE faculty runs deep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Blood is thicker than water. Well, <laughs> you can have it. All thank the best. Right. Thank you, Richard, for last year. It was lovely. And I no doubt you've done a fantastic job with the children. Thank you very much. You probably have, mate. Unscrew. That's new. Yeah, no, you, no. Sir. Over to you, Craig. Yeah, yeah, you sit down. You, sir. Get down. Thanks, Oh, Lord. thanks. Oh, horror. Right out. What about Park you, miss? <laughs> Thank you, mate. <laughs> How do you spell you, sir? Oh, I need glasses. I don't need them to be glasses. Can't find. Since I've become aware of, you know, the things that the members in this, this organisation are up to, I just haven't been able to, haven't been able to sleep at night. I've been... And when I do, I wake up in a cold sweat. Uh, just, I've lost my appetite. I can't eat anymore. Uh, you know, I've, I've even had death threats from from some of the members. You know, I've had bricks thrown through my windows and my car key. It's just, it's just horrible. These people need to be stopped. Yeah. Well, for example, one of the members. Well, let's just say I wouldn't trust her around in some U sevens with a bag of lollies. You know, I don't really feel for him, but you know, I feel feel in, the, in my heart for the, the blue colour, you know, hard working Aussies who have given their kids their money in good faith, and you know, this this shonky bloke comes along and you know rips them off and you know takes their money away. It's just it's just you know hard to hard to swallow. You know, he he looks. He looks the part, you know, he looks, you know, honest and good and everything, but he's just 
No, it's just bad news. She's been stealing money intended for orphans in Africa and spending it all on booze and, you know, in the pokies. It's just not cricket. She'd be good, but you know she's she's stealing a free religious publication and flogging it off. You know, and at a, at, you know she's made hundreds of dollars selling this stolen free religious newspaper. It's just disgusting. You want five? 